And here we are again with Fuckdale Sock Cock Time. Drop your cocks and grab your socks. There's military muster on the flight dick of 7A fucking M. And yes, I said flight dick. <laughs> and it's spelled D-E-C-K, but it's pronounced dick. <laughs> it's a dictionary. <laughs> uh, shall I put you behind bars? <laughs> Get your ass behind the bars, fucker. <laughs> you're under you're under you're under motherfucking house arrest. <laughs> You're under motherfucking warrant. Get your ass behind bars. <laughs> Bitch, get your ass behind the bars. You get to look at me from behind the bars. <laughs> Those are Wilhelm Wright Cloudbuster copper bars, too. <laughs> and they got a little bit of iron in them. Some silver and gold, too. <laughs> you need some Ormus for your warmest? <laughs> God, man, I got to get this fucking splinter out of the hand. How am I going to get it the fuck out? I put a poultice on it. You have to look it up, see what a poultice is. A poltergeist. Soap and sugar. <laughs> so so said the evil witch doctor on YouTube or suck and suck. <laughs> she said, put a poultice on it, and naturally the splinter will come out in 24 hours. It's magic. It's magic. Do you believe in magic? <laughs> hey, magic. <laughs> hey. <laughs> you want to you want to see the cloud buster from behind bars? Look. It's a cloud buster from behind bars. <laughs> Did you get you some weenie? Get brother brother here to have some weenie. I need some weenie round here. Weenie round here. Everybody needs some weenie round here. See, I teach, I, I share with everyone that we all need some weenie around here, right? Because <laughs> we need this and weenie that. We, we, the people, the real people need this and we need that because we're tired of all the crap. <laughs> And that's what I have to share around here. <laughs> Whenever I get in the mood as I see fit. Because that's just who I am. <laughs> and no, none of us got locked down around here. If you got locked down in your area, tough titties. <laughs> You better go to the YouTuber called Winston Shrout and figure out how to write a claim. <laughs> and then publicly announce that claim <laughs> so that all the people around you know what's going on in the community. <laughs> Otherwise, the titties are tough, man. The tits are tough. Tits for tots. And there's lots of kitties around. So, <laughs> anyway, so we're back at our favorite radio circle here. This is the circle jerk, where I walk a circle here counterclockwise. <laughs> That's a big counterclaim, counterclockwise. <laughs> and, I, and I know how to uh, rap and rhyme and charade with all the rhyming words. <laughs> <laughs> as I see fit <laughs> and I cast spells I'm a magician I'm a magic I do black magic white magic and all the 84 colors in the crayon box magic <laughs> as I see fit <laughs> and I don't care what no one thinks and I do care what no one thinks and I don't do, and I don't do. <laughs> and I don't do, and I don't do. <laughs> I do whatever the hell I want. Because that's just who I am. Because I created this spot. <laughs> See this spot, this yard right here? 
I created that. That's a lot of hard ass fucking work to create what I do in this yard right here. <laughs> and I earned every last bit of it. <laughs> so that's why I get to do whatever the fuck I want in this spot right here. <laughs> until it gets expanded out further and further and further and further and further. <laughs> Although I use reason though, because I have a public storefront and I have neighbors and people around and other creatures who get easily offended at, 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 at certain things. So, you know, I, I slowly but surely graduate, gr gradually, you know, you know, share the delicate information <laughs> but yet bring the hard alcohol right on in when it's needed <laughs> all in front of everyone's ears too with nothing to hide <laughs> and i maintain friendships with all the neighbors and all the people around too imagine that i ain't got a fucking single enemy around here jeez that's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> no one fucks with me. No one burns the house down. No one throws eggs at the windows. No one shoots bullets toward me. <laughs> no one tries to run me off the road. <laughs> Although some people get mad because they think I need to be driving faster <laughs> or they think I need to be riding someone's bumper. <laughs> there are some fit throwers around here though, but those are probably the ones that don't know who I am because <laughs> there's 350,000 of, of, of us all congregated around here in this tiny little sardine can, can called Lane County, Oregon. That's right. I'll let you all know exactly where, you, where, where we're all at, too. And if you want to come visit us, that's up to you. But right as it is right now, your ass is locked down. And you don't get to leave. <laughs> I'm a private military federal fucking judge. And I give everyone the address where I live. I don't fucking hide like the rest of these all, the rest of all these other public motherfucking judges. They got something to hide all the time. <laughs> uh, and I got the paperwork to back it up. <laughs> And the governor here, Oregon, Kate Brown, knows exactly who I am, <laughs> as do the head fucking attorneys and the sheriffs, <laughs> and word gets around and gets around. <laughs> like I said, that's just what I created here. I created this position, this existence, and it was a lot of fucking hard-ass motherfucking work, too. <laughs> and it took a long fucking time. <laughs> it ain't gonna happen for you tomorrow unless all the people get together without paperwork <laughs> and somehow rise up and demand all this fuck fest society to change right to fuck now. <laughs> I mean, it could happen that way too. Otherwise, you're going to have to get the crayons out and the pen and the paper and create the life that you want with an affidavit and get all these fuckers to agree with everything that you want in life. And then publicly post and declare everything that you want on a daily basis and start living that way. <laughs> That's the only way I found, folks. <laughs> but I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just sharing with you what I've accomplished. That's all. <laughs> I don't plan on fucking dying either. <laughs> I plan on living forever. I plan on all the secret military information and technology at the highest levels, both public and private and inside of me to be coming out. <laughs> and includes all the, all the uh, aliens and extraterrestrials and where the fuck other creatures there are out there hiding in the universe. They need to pop right out and out and reveal themselves. <laughs> Whether it be uh, a Project Blue, Bre Blue Beam fake media event or not. <laughs> That's part of the secret military technology. So if we have a fake, milita a fake military uh, technology alien landing with ships come around here and all that shit just realize 
probably it's it's gonna be a fake show. 